about mom. He's, he and Jim have known her the longest out of everybody here. Um, and then my uncle Jim will be doing a blessing, and then we will have the cake after that. So thanks again for being here. First of all, thanks for the invitation. If I project, can you hear me okay in the back? Uh, it's great to be here and see all of you who have had such an impact on Sharon's life, and hopefully vice versa. Although, as her little brother, I don't want to give her too much credit. <laughs> I had just a few remarks I wanted to make about Sharon and our life together. Uh, 10 minutes and 34 seconds, if anybody wants to time me. <laughs> uh, but basically, uh, Sharon's maiden name was Freeling, meaning spring or springtime in German. We three, Sharon and Jim and I, are products of a German-Danish English heritage with some very deep roots in eastern Nebraska. Uh, our father was born in a rural parsonage near Johnson, Nebraska, a town of about 120. Uh, one in a long line of Lutheran ministers. Uh, our mother was born in York, Nebraska. If you're driving down the interstate in uh, Nebraska, you see the big uh, uh, water tower that's made up like a like a balloon. That's York. Uh, they met in about 1950. Uh, she was a product of a uh, successful farmer and a classically trained vocalist and music teacher, which is where Sharon's talent comes from. I think was mom's side. 